Smart rings are suitable for subtle, always available, and eyes-free interaction. However, both input and output capabilities are still limited in comparison to other technologies. Frictio is a smart ring that provides passive, kinesthetic force feedback as a viable output method for rotational input. It provides variable friction force that opposes the rotation of the ring. Frictio is composed of a ring, a braking mechanism, a motor that actuates the brake, and supporting circuitry. To demonstrate the capability of this new output channel, six force profiles were designed, implemented, and tested in a user study. No force allows users to rotate the ring freely. With resistant force, the ring is still rotatable but requires extra effort from users. A hard stop prevents the ring from being rotated at all. With ramp up, the friction force applied to the ring increases as the rotation angle increases. With ramp down, the ring becomes progressively easier to rotate. Bump temporarily applies a high friction force, giving a brief stopping feeling. To illustrate the utility of ring-based haptic feedback, several sample applications were explored. Frequently checking the time is considered socially inappropriate in many settings. To mitigate this, Frictio can be used to indicate the time until the next meeting. For instance, the ring becomes unmovable if the user is late to the next meeting. Providing precise rotary input on a smart ring requires fine motor control or continuous visual attention. This challenge can be mitigated by providing haptic landmarks around the targets using bump feedback, for instance, every 45 degrees of rotation. With this combination lock application, users can unlock their devices using a series of alternating rotations. Traditional gaming inputs can be mapped to the rotational nature of the device. In this game, the user can rotate the ring with ramp up or ramp down force profiles to indicate the angle and power of the slingshot. Quickly rotating the ring in the opposite direction releases the brake, giving users additional haptic feedback. During a movie, a user may want to see their phone screen if they receive a call, which will disrupt the other viewers. Frictio can be used for eyes-free call display with predefined profile mappings. We evaluated how the passive kinesthetic force feedback can be used as an effective and recognizable output channel. In the studies, participants were standing or walking at a speed of 3 km an hour on a treadmill, and with or without a secondary task. The results indicated that most force profiles could be easily distinguished, even under conditions where users' physical or mental workload was high. 